Hi guys, this is my second declutter of concealers and foundations that are in this kind of uh, containers. I've been doing decluttering on my own without filming it on YouTube for a while every quarter. So I don't expect uh, that I, would, I will have a lot of products to get rid of, but I will try to do my best to condense my makeup. So the first one is Maybelline Dream Lumi Touch Highlighting Concealer in Ivory. I will give this to my friend because she wanted to try it. And I already finished one for myself in my project pen. So that's bye bye. And this one is Bobbi Brown Corrector in Light Bisque. Probably this is my fourth or third pen and I already hit pan on it. This is my favorite corrector. And um, well, uh, but I kind of got sick of it. I mean, sick of using the same product over and over again. So next time I will get the creamy concealer one instead of this one. Um, so that's that. And this one is one of my favorite, favorite of all time concealer. This is Makeup Forever Full Cover uh, Waterproof. It says Extreme Camouflage Cream. This covers everything, but it kind of creases under your eyes and it's kind of dry for that area. So if you use it on your spots, it's great. And also, when I travel really, really light, I take this and I mix my moisturizer uh, with its concealer a little bit uh, to make foundation. And then if some of the spots are not concealed, I go over uh, my spots with this one again. So I will definitely buy this again. This, al this is almost finished. And another one is... Uh, Sonia Kashuk Hidden Agenda Concealer Palette in Light. And this screen, I don't use it. This is too dark for me. This is fine. And this setting powder, I use it my under eyes. And um, I will probably use these two up and then get rid of this. And these two are... The Sam Cover Perfection Tip Concealer, one is in 101, focus, and the other one is in 2. This is too light, this is too dark, so I heard that they came out with 1.51, so when I'm finished with these two, I will probably get that one, but these two work perfect. I think these are the cheaper version of this Makeup Forever full cover one. So yeah, I will always get this. This is not open yet because I got this one for my sister. And this is um, It Cosmetics Bye Bye, Bye Under Eye Under Eye in light. This one is too light for me. Um, so I will give this a try again like to see if it's too light uh, again. I think I uh, when I used it, it was in the summer, so probably now I got more pale, so it kind of would fit me. I will see. And this one is Misha's by um, Under Eye Brightener in Natural Beige. I haven't opened it, I need to try it. This is Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in light. This is too orange for me, so I use it my under my eyes only. But I like the cons I mean, I like the consistency, but I don't like the shade. I need to get a lighter one. So, that's well, until I get the lighter one, I mean, the fair one, I will keep that. This one is a pencil concealer Spot Eraser Concealer Pencil by Mustaf. I lost the Rimmel Scandalize uh, pencil liner in nude, so I'm using this concealer on my waterline instead of the Rimmel one. So I'm keeping that. In the concealer section, I'm not doing too well. I'm getting rid of this and probably will finish it soon. And We'll get rid of this one as soon as I get the fair one. 
then for the foundations, I'm going to get rid of this SK2 uh, Cream Compact Foundation in uh, 30310 because it all dried up. Whoops. So you should, if you see the ream, they are separate and it's really dry. You, I can't even get even swatch from that. I'm so mad that I spent so much money on this. I think I spent like $80 on this one alone. And this is bye bye. I'm not going to repurchase that. And this one, I will be finished with it soon. Uh, Magic Any Cushion by Etude House in mint, I guess. Yes, this is the cushiony type. You have a puff and then this the cushion type of thing it has the green um green makeup corrector uh skin corrector that corrects any redness on your skin so it's almost gone now so i will finish with that i don't have many cushion uh cushiony type of foundations because i i personally tried them tried uh more than 10 of the products and i didn't really like them uh, so I usually give them to my sisters or my mom or my friends and that's why I don't, I don't have many and this another one is a uh, foundation by a Etude House in one I'm I made like I, I hit major pen on this this was quite moisturizing it had the whirls of um, what do you call the serums and it gave beautiful glow to your skin. The only uh, pet peeves of mine is that it's too pink. Too light, too pink. Uh, beautiful texture. But I think I'm done with this and I got my money's worth out of it. So bye bye to that. Next one. This is one of my recent favorites. The Body Shop Extra Version Minerals, and I believe that this uh, was in shade 2, and I got this on 50% off sale, and I'm really pleased with the results that this, this gives. It has the foundation and a little brush, and this is, I think, a dupe for the Arma Giorgio Armani's uh, the Compact Cream Foundation. I personally didn't like the texture of that one, the Armani one, and I think this is so much uh, better for the money that you spend on this, on, on a foundation. So I really uh, recommend this if this is not discontinued. And this one is actually, uh, didn't have any foundation inside. This is uh, a Pew Smart Cushion. I got the case. What it had was it had the little puffs and also this cushion type of thing and you DIY your foundation inside. You can mix everything like shimmering uh, bases or foundations and, and find the perfect consistency of your own. So I made my own and I really love it so I'm not going to get rid of this. And this one, I haven't even opened it yet. This is EcoSoul Luminous real serum BB cake SPF 30 PA++++ and this one looks like it has a puff and this one looks like this I haven't touched it yet I will try it and tell you how I like it and also this is in shade 1 so far from the foundations uh, that are in this in this type of case I'm getting rid of I'm throwing out two and probably will be I will be done with this one soon so I think I did not do too well on this but yeah um, it's better to do something than nothing uh, I will see you in my next one and thank you for watching bye